Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know that Microsoft Edge could be getting a new sharing menu in the Edge browser, and this will just help to simplify the process of all you know the sharing you would need to do between your different devices and platforms. Now I have Microsoft Edge Canary open, which is a pre-release unstable version of the Edge browser used for testing and experimenting. Now currently in Microsoft Edge, if you want to share a web page, as an example, if I just search for any random web page, ABC, and I go to the top right to my three dotted menu and I click on share, it gives me these options. You know, you can share with your people, your contacts, you can turn on nearby sharing to share using Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, your phone, copy link, and so on. This is a little bit clunky and looks a little bit dated. Now, in uh, the recent versions of Edge Canary, there is a new menu which is designed to basically simplify the process um, to the options that you would be using the most often to share between your different devices and your different social platforms. Now, this option is not enabled by default, so if you don't see it, the new share menu, what you can do is you can just pop over to your Edge flags. So in your address bar, just go up there and you're typing Edge colon forward slash forward slash flags. That's Edge colon forward slash forward slash flags. And in the search, you just type in share. And this will bring up Microsoft Edge Share menu enables the new share menu and this is available for Mac, Windows and Linux. And then you just change the default setting to enabled and then you have to restart Edge Canary to apply the flag. Now obviously this is only if you don't see this option which you know on some uh, Edge Canary browsers is, is enabled by default but if you are like me in Edge Canary and you don't see the option you can and enable it with this uh, share menu flag. Now, if I go back to the same web page, ABC, and I go back up to my share menu, you will see now that I have a couple of more options. And, you know, you can copy link as previously. You can share with Facebook, Twitter, Outlook, um, LinkedIn, and so on. And also, if you are using Gmail, um, you will also be able to uh, share with your Gmail. And that's, of course, if you are signed into those uh, services with the same account you are using in edge and then also for whatever reason you know it's you can also um share uh, email to your email to myself so if you have something you would just like to email to yourself which i do quite um, frequently you have the option now to add my email address choose email provider you can also obviously if you are signed in um with your gmail on the same account this will also appear here and then you just type in your address and you can save that and send it straight through to your own uh, email account. So I think this is a handy little option, just giving you um, some extra uh, sharing options. You can see here we've brought up the old menu by clicking on Windows Share Options as well. So hopefully this will be making its way down to a stable version of the Microsoft Edge web browser in the not too distant future. And I think this is, you know, just makes things a little bit more user friendly and accessible um, hopefully in Microsoft Edge in the not too distant future. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.